Hey YouTube, um, thanks for the 50 subscribers, um, thanks for that, I was, I told you I was, I'm gonna make a ray gun, but, um, I'm still making that, it takes some time, um, but before I wanted to make that, I wanted to make a new mech, and I made a new mech, it's a semi-automatic mech that can hold up to five rubber bands, so, um, like one of these rubber bands, so they stretch really long and they're really strong. So, um, yeah, I finally made one with the, with my available Technic pieces, because I don't have a lot, so I only have, like, a little bit, so everywhere I look, they have at least one piece that I don't have, but, um, I made up my own. But before I couldn't make it up because I, I couldn't think of how it would work. <clears throat> but I finally did. And here's my mech. And it's on this gun. Kind of like, it's really long. It's supposed to be just like a pistol, but the gear is already like halfway. So if I like put it right here, then it wouldn't stretch that far. So <clears throat> yeah, so here's my new mech. It's semi automatic, holds five rubber bands. It's really easy, simple. Um, <clears throat> so what happens is, uh, since this is being pulled, this trigger right here is pulled on a rubber band. It it just pulls it over here, but then there's a piece of here that stops it. So it gives it tension to, uh, you know, just like a regular trigger. But this part right here, this part right here, um, is connected to the gear. So, um, since you have a rubber band here on the gear, it wants to go this way, it wants to go forward. So what it does, it's, it pushes it like this. And what happens is that if, since it wants to go that way, but it can't do it anymore because this trigger is blocking it. But once you press the trigger, it goes inside like that. And then it goes like that. So it's kind of like inside. And then when you slowly let go it'll um it'll kind of like push it up and then the the rubber band's tension will release will um pull it so that it goes and then of course that stops it again too for the next rubber band so um um uh, i don't think this is anybody's mech um but i did get um uh, but I, I will give like half credit to, um, I think his name is, uh, Audit Ya 32 or something like that, um, to his, uh, semi-automatic mech. It's this one that has like 13,000 views or something. I watched that and then I, I, was, I said, oh, oh, I can probably make that. And then I looked at my Legos and I didn't have like the L-shaped piece and all that. So what I did is I kind of improv kind of improvised and then made my own version with the pieces that I have, so, I'll give them half credit, but, um, or some credit, but this is still kind of like my, my mech, because it's like, it's not shaped like his, and it doesn't have the right pieces like his, but it's kind of like the same concept, so, I'll show you, the, I'll show you me loading it up, <clears throat> and then I'm going to shoot these targets. And then once that snapping noise, if you hear that snapping noise, that means it's locked. So it's it loaded one rubber band or whatever. 